Hello friends, this is Shravan. This is my YouTube channel, Civil Engineering by Shravan. To subscribe my channel, click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates. In this video, I will explain you what are the different types of the IS code books we will use for designing of any kind of the structure. So before designing of any kind of the structure, generally we will consider some important code books which are uh, useful for designing of any kind of the structure, whether it is comes to your respected first story building or second story building or third story building or fourth story building or fifth story building or G plus 10 building, any one of the building. Okay. So basically we will consider eight number of code books for designing of any kind of the structure. In this video, I will explain the details of this respected eight number of code books. Okay. So I will explain you the uh, code number and the code year along with that respected code year. I will explain you the details about that respected code. Okay. So in that first one is IS 456-2000 code. Okay. So this is the plain and reinforced concrete code for practice. So this is the general code for civil engineers used for designing of any kind of the members. Okay. Which is related to your beam sections or column sections or slab sections. Okay, so we will use IS 456-2000 code. So this is the first code, plain and reinforced concrete code for practice. So this code was released in 2000 year. Okay, so this is the first one. Second one is IS 10262-2016 code. Okay, so IS 10262-2016 comma IS 456-2000. So along with that, we have one more code is there. That is SP23. So these three code books will be helpful for designing of the mixed design of the concrete. Okay. So the mixed design is nothing but the proportioning of the respected ingredients in concrete mixture. So the mixed proportion will be depending upon your strength of the concrete. So whether it is comes under your respected M20 grade concrete or M30 grade concrete or M35, M40 grade concrete. So depending upon your requirement, we have to design that respected concrete mixture. Okay. So for designing of that respected concrete mix, we need to have IS 456-2000 code, IS 1026-2016 code and SP23 code. This code works will be helpful for calculating the concrete mix design. Okay. So this is the second one. Third one is IS 1893-2016. Okay. So this IS 1893-2016 is the code book which is helpful for calculating the seismic loading conditions and what are the different types of the seismic zones are there in India. Okay. The name of this respected code is criteria for earthquake resistant design of the structure. Okay. The criteria for designing of earthquake resistant structure is comes under your 1893-2016 code. Okay. So this is the use of the third code. Okay. Next one is IS 875-2007. Okay. So this is the uh, code book generally we will consider for calculating the uh, load cases except the seismic loading condition. So we have already have one uh, code book is there for calculating the seismic loading condition, which is nothing but your earthquake loading condition that is IS 1893-2016. So except that respected load cases, we will consider dead loading condition, live loading condition as well as wind loading condition by using this respected code IS 875-2007 part 3. Okay. So we will consider this respected part 3 only for the uh, wind loading concept point of view. So if you want to calculate another load cases which is related to your respected dead loading condition or live loading condition, we will consider part 1 as well as part 2 code. Okay. This code book was released in 2007 year. Okay. So this is the fourth code book generally we will use for designing of the building. Okay. Next one is fifth one is IS 800-2007 code. So this is the general construction of the steel structure code practice name. Okay. This code book was released in 2007 year. For designing of any kind of the structure which is related to your steel members, we will consider this respected code. Okay. For designing of industrial warehouse and industrial structure or else if you design the respected ground story or uh, auditorium building. So for building this respected steel structure, we will consider this respected code. Okay. IS 800-2007 code is the code for practice of steel structures. Okay. So this is the fifth one. Now next code is IS 1343-1343. 1980 code. Okay. So this code was related to pre-stressed concrete. Okay. Code of practice for pre-stressed concrete structures. Okay. This is the code book generally we will use for designing of pre-stressed members. Pre-stressed members are nothing but the beam sections or else column section which are already designed in the respected uh, industry. They are directly transported to the respected site and in that respected site they will be installed for this respected building construction process. Okay. So this is the that IS 1343 and 1980 code will be helpful for designing of these respected models, which is related to your respected pre-stressed members. Okay. So this is the sixth one. 
Now next code is IS-13-1920 which was released in 1997 year. This code book will be helpful for designing of tactile structure subjected to your respected seismic loading condition. Okay, so if you apply seismic loading condition for this respected any kind of the building which is related to your ductile material structure, generally we will consider IS 13920 1997 code. So this is the code of the practice for designing of ductile resistant structure. Okay, so this is the seventh one. And last one is IS 13935. 1993 okay this code book will be helpful for repairs in building and designing of earthquake resistant structure okay so if you apply seismic loading condition for that respected any kind of the building so we have to design that respected building to overcome that respected earthquake load so for that reason we have to design the earthquake resistant structure so in that respected earthquake designing resistant structure we will use is13935 1997 code okay 1993 code so this code book will be helpful for repairs as well as designing of earthquake resistance structure so this eight number of code books will be helpful for designing of any kind of the building okay which is related to your respective load cases okay so if you have any queries about this respected video please text me your comments in the below comment box i will give you the answers for that respected question thank you